Glass is a really unique thing. It's transformed humanity in many instances. You know, it helps us to see, it enhances our vision. It helps us to see the stars. It helped us to learn about our universe. It helped us to see the smallest of things and helped to inform us about science. It's a magical thing that it's transformed us. It's changed us psychologically. And it goes back so far into history that you can see these moments where the glass really changed us. The experience of working with glass is truly inspiring. For me, a very rewarding process. It forces you to be in the moment. Your world fades away and all distractions are gone. And you have this freedom to express yourself once you learn the material, to be yourself and to be free in the moment. I think that glass has characteristics that other materials don't. And from narrative perspectives, you can take glass and do things with it that you can't in other creative areas. And it becomes this object for self-reflection. It becomes this object for fragility. It becomes this object that you can kind of transpose all these ideas and all these concepts. The excitement that people bring in and bring out is honestly, I think, kind of what keeps us going because it's a it's an awesome material to play with um, so being able to bring that enthusiasm out of somebody is really fantastic a lot of people come into Seneca and say that they are coming here because they want to get away from what they do in their daily lives and so I think art is somewhat of an escape for a lot of people like I think that's a big reason why Seneca makes a difference to people Because glass is such a unique material and it has such potential to transform, you know, in a lot of ways. And so the organization filled a very big hole in our community and in our region, really, because there was no access. There was no place for people to come and make glass. So the nonprofit was born out of the, the need for accessible, affordable places for artists to work. And, you know, it grew rapidly into a place for programming to take place with partners to help people. So often our programming relies on one another. And so when we rely on one another, there's that communication component, there's that trust component. And I think that a material that's so hands-on that requires a community working together um, has a very powerful therapeutic outcome. Glass is perfect for kids because they're so curious about the material. And so they come to it with that curiosity that they bring to the world. And there's this discovery of not only the material itself, but also the science behind it. We've done programming in health and wellness with One Safe Place, with uh, Project Success and the Presbyterian Night Shelter and the Art Station. We've done programming in education with the Fort Worth ISD, with private schools, with the JJELP program within the Fort Worth ISD. We've done programming with a lot of great partners and we look forward to expanding that. When I teach people how to utilize this medium for self-expression, I don't tell them how to do it. I simply guide them in what they already know, right? So if somebody feels, you know, broken somewhere inside, then I say, hey, you know, glass breaks. Why don't we go make something and let's just break it? You know, I'd like people to know that we're more than just a glass making studio. We reach into our community and in these partnerships that we can enhance their lives, we can enhance community. I'd like people to know that we do much more than make things, but we make a difference. 
the resources needed to to be ready for our, the next phase and to do to implement the programming we've outlined um, is is so important. We truly need more support financially. Part of what you pay to take a class pays a little bit for our programming to where people who can't afford it, um, but also donating, donating money, donating your time to volunteering here. All those can be helpful. If we don't have the staff to make it work, um, this doesn't exist, quite honestly. This is a, a city that is full of culture and it was void of glass. So I felt compelled, as the founders all did, to help elevate in our community, the community we grew up in, uh, what we have found to be so important to us. And so often, being creative and being expressive helps us through challenge. And that, I think, creates these unique moments of opportunity for us to express ourselves, to, to make, to heal, and so through all that we've been through, what Seneca offers, what Seneca is uniquely positioned to bring to the community is incredibly valuable.